Well, first of all, this election is more than Herschel Walker. This election is about the people. Senate candidate Herschel Walker has penis on the mind. Yes, you heard that correctly. Uh, he said this erection is for the people. In fact, uh, he said it so clearly that Lindsey Graham had to, you know, he did a quick. <laughs> In fact, let's watch that video one more time because I want you to pay close attention to his surroundings. And before we go to it, let me just make one more point. You should not be thinking about erections when you're sandwiched between Ted Cruz and Lindsey Graham. But let's watch again. Well, first of all, this election is more than Herschel Walker. This election is about the people. <laughs> John, I, I mean, look, is he right? Is this erection about the people? I think this election has been about erections more so than any other election <laughs> in the past or hopefully going forward. I would love to just have two candidates where I don't have to think about anything they did with their genitals. I think that would be great. I want to go back to that. But while many people, including myself this morning, assumed that this was a Freudian slip around his sexual scandals and issues and all that. He was, as you said, sandwiched between Ted Cruz and Lindsey Graham. Maybe it wasn't his erection that was causing the problem. Maybe he noticed that one of them, maybe, oh, you know, God. No, look, look, oh. let's be fair. Let's be serious and let's be fair. Right now, there is a winter storm bearing down on Texas. Ted Cruz is facing the possibility of being able to once again abandon his constituents to go to Cancun. Maybe that has given him a sexual thrill. Maybe that's why he's doing it. I don't know. Can we send Ted Cruz there and then build the wall? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> Obviously, I don't want the wall, but it would be nice if Ted Cruz went away. Um, by the way, I love how you uh, drew attention to the possibility of those gremlins having erections and then <laughs> followed it with let's be fair. Sure, real fair to me, John, <laughs> by bringing that up. <laughs> by anyway. Way. Oh, is that hmm. No, I, I was gonna move on to a wonderful compilation video that our producer Taylor Ellis put together. But before I do, what did you wanna say? Yeah, it just made me think of, do you remember when Peter Griffin was being interviewed and someone said, Mr. Griffin, where do you see yourself in five years? And he thinks, don't say doing your wife, don't say doing your wife, don't say doing your wife, doing your wife. <laughs> like he's got two minders just trying to keep him <laughs> relatively on track. Don't talk about your penis. I know that they had that talk with him. Don't talk about your penis. Don't talk about your penis erection. By the way, uh, yeah, I mean, but the thing with Herschel Walker is he's the gift who keeps on giving because the cringy moments never stop flowing with uh, Herschel Walker. In fact, here's a little taste. I was watching this movie. I was watching this movie called Fright Night, Freak Night, or some kind of night. But it was about vampires. So I've been telling this little story about this bull out in the field with six cows, and three of them are pregnant. So you know you got something going on. If that is true, why are there still apes? Are you do you support any new gun laws in the wake of this Texas shooting? Do what now? Do you support new gun laws in the wake well, of this Texas like shooting? To do, what I like to do is see it. And, uh, and everything and stuff. I like to see it. You know. I don't know if you know vampires and cool people, are they not? But I'm gonna tell you something that I found out. A werewolf can kill a vampire, did you know that? I never knew that, so I didn't want to be a vampire anymore, I want to be a werewolf. You know, he talked about doing a disinformation. What about getting a department that can look at young men that's looking at uh, women, that's looking at uh, just social media? What the heck is a pronoun? <laughs> I'm like, I'm tired, my pronoun is sick and tired of these pronouns. <laughs> because right now, these pronouns are gonna get all men and women in the service killed. So I'm watching my TV, are these kids watching their TV, or a vampire kill on their TV? So you know it's kind of stupid, but I'm still watching though. But since we don't control the air, I was good air decided to float over to China, bad air. <laughs> so when China gets out of good air, their bad air gotta move. And you know what's so funny? I am with, with many police officers. <sighs> he thinks he's got a real badge. He thinks he's a real cop. But he likes vampires. He does. He really does. John. I you like vampires too, right? You're into that kind of stuff. What? <laughs> I don't own one of those bears. What are you talking about? Um. Anyway, yeah, his his 
terrible recounting of a vampire werewolf movie is one of the most uh, charismatic things about him on this. No, listening to him talk, he makes Donald Trump seem like a reasonable person to put into government office. Like he makes he makes Trump seem competent by comparison. Like I don't think that Herschel Walker should literally be in charge of anything, even in his own life. Like I, <laughs> my <can't>, God, <laughs> no, he should not be in charge of his. He should not be driving himself. And I'm not just saying that because he has told stories about driving to go murder someone and only the voice of God in his head stopped him. I'm not talking about that. He should not be in charge of literally anything. He is out of his GD mind and he definitely should not be a senator. I have a lot of hope that the runoff is gonna go the right way, but this is just madness. And and look, if, if it wasn't just the incompetence, the predilection for massive lying and hypocrisy and his values, like he is not qualified in every way that a person cannot be qualified to hold office. Thanks for watching The Young Turks, I really appreciate it. Another way to show support is through YouTube memberships. You'll get to interact with us more. There's live chat emojis, badges. You've got emojis of me, Anna, John, JR. So those are super fun. But you also get playback of our exclusive member only shows and specials right after they air. So all that, all you gotta do is click that join button right underneath the video. Thank you.